Hi, my name is Dr. Subra Anantram and I'm a senior lecturer in international business in the School of Management at Curtin Business School. Uh, I'm very passionate about teaching and doing research in international business and international human resource management. Uh, I currently teach units such as international management and global business dynamics uh, and primarily do research in the areas of foreign direct investment, ethical decision making, global mindset development, as well as demotion. Uh, I currently also coordinate a new and exciting postgraduate course called the Master of International Business and Entrepreneurship. My students come from all across the globe and I tap into this diversity to create a classroom of engaged co-educators. Uh, I do so predominantly using the flipped method where the lecture is online uh, and then students engage with that and then come to the classroom uh, which is a face-to-face -face workshop held in our state-of-the-art collaborative teaching facilities. Uh, this helps create a classroom of engaged learners. Um, I also get my students to uh, participate in providing peer feedback. Uh, this gives them a sense of responsibility. Uh, and I also encourage students to develop their digital literacy and oral communication skills. Uh, primarily using uh, technology-enabled tools, uh, as these skill sets are predominantly very important for graduates of the future. Well, Curtin is ranked in the top 1% of universities worldwide. Uh, it's a truly international university, uh, has got over 51,000 students, and we've got a number of fantastic campuses across the globe, uh, such as in Perth, uh, in Mauritius, in Dubai, in uh, Malaysia, as well as in Singapore. Uh, so students have a lot of flexibility uh, when they enroll in courses at Curtin University. So they can choose from a range of different majors. They can combine different majors as well uh, going forward. Uh, Curtin is also heavily industry connected and students have a number of opportunities to engage in on-campus as well as off-campus uh, industry-based events as well as internships uh, and such work integrated learning um, helps students become industry ready. Uh, moreover, students also have several opportunities to participate in uh, international study tours uh, as well as uh, overseas uh, study abroad and exchange arrangements that we have with a number of leading universities across the globe. Uh, all in all, this provides students with a truly multicultural uh, experience. Uh, well, Perth is consistently ranked among the, the best cities in the world um, uh, to live in. Uh, and in my opinion, Perth really enjoys all the benefits of a, a big, well-developed uh, city with fantastic infrastructure and transport, uh, as well as uh, all the advantages of a laid-back um, country-style town uh, compared to you know, some of the more populous cities that we have uh, over east. Uh, it's a very student-friendly city. Uh, there are lots of advantages for students in terms of concessions in public transport, uh, and the cost of uh, renting is also very affordable in Perth. Uh, I also love Perth because of its proximity to Asia, uh, Europe and Africa and makes it uh, a lot more convenient to travel to and from those locations uh, compared to say if you were in one of the eastern cities. Uh, Perth is also exceptionally multicultural uh, and has a wonderful diverse uh, population uh, from around the world. It also boasts restaurants and grocery stores from uh, around the globe, which is uh, something that students would, would really appreciate. Um, moreover, Perth enjoys uh, wonderful weather all year round, and we've got some of the, the best beaches uh, on this planet. Uh, and having been very fortunate to travel to many places around the world, uh, I feel that there's no city in the world which enjoys uh, you know, blue skies like we do in Perth, and I always look forward to returning back. Uh, the Bentley campus is just truly incredible. It's uh, vast, it's expansive, it's picturesque, and it's really buzzing during uh, semesters. And students can really immerse themselves in a truly uh, multicultural experience. Uh, 
uh, it really has everything from the state-of-the-art collaborative teaching facilities, including our purpose-built uh, facilities such as the agency and the trading room, as well as the management decision headquarters, which is going to be uh, inaugurated in 2019. Uh, we also have a wonderful library. There are a number of cafes, restaurants, food trucks. Uh, we've got a wonderful art gallery on campus, a uh, state-of-the-art gym. Um, basketball courts, tennis facilities and other recreational facilities on campus and there are also a number of uh, cultural food and industry based events uh, all year round on campus. So all of this combined will really keep the students engaged and busy and also give them a wonderful learning as well as a life experience while they are here on campus for their studies. Well, Curtin is a truly diverse international university and boasts over 51,000 students from uh, all over the globe. Uh, not only does Curtin attract a diverse uh, student cohort, uh, but even the teaching staff come from different parts of the world uh, and represent a truly international workforce. So students can experience a truly multicultural experience while on campus. Uh, when they engage with fellow students and interact with uh, teaching staff across our wonderful teaching facilities. Now these friendships and uh, professional connections really provide students a wonderful opportunity to foster uh, both formal as well as informal networks which can last them a lifetime. I met so many wonderful friends on campus when I was a student and I'm still in touch with a lot of them some of whom continued on in Perth, others moved to the eastern states, while still others uh, have moved to different corners of the globe. Well, Curtin Business School is one of the top business schools in Australia and it's the university of choice for Western Australia with a 51% domestic market share. Uh, we have over 13,000 students uh, from over 90 countries around the world and there's a wide range of accredited as well as internationally recognized courses for students to choose from. So for example, our Bachelor of Commerce give students the opportunities to choose uh, from 22 different majors and they all cover different uh, aspects of the, the, the commerce or business discipline, so to speak. So students can specialize in an area that they're really passionate about uh, and then also choose a minor in, in one of the other complementary uh, business disciplines. Uh, students could also choose double majors uh, as well as double degrees uh, uh, across faculties. Um, we also have a, a host of uh, postgraduate courses and we've got some exciting new ones on offer. Uh, so for example, the Master of Luxury Branding, uh, which is the first of its kind in Australia, uh, and also the Master of International Business and Entrepreneurship, uh, which combines the two interrelated disciplines of international business and entrepreneurship and provides students with the, the necessary confidence, knowledge and skill sets for a career uh, to build their own startup or get employed in multinational corporations and help them expand overseas. Um, we've got some wonderful teaching facilities uh, as well, um, uh, not just our state-of-the-art collaborative teaching facilities, but we've got some purpose-built facilities such as the agency, uh, which is a social media command center, uh, which allows students to experience firsthand how brands uh, can monitor their online presence and when you develop your social media marketing and analytics in real time. Uh, we've also got a wonderful trading room uh, which simulates a real life stock market trading environment. Uh, it's got 20 live uh, Bloomberg professional terminals, uh, live international news services and stock prices. Uh, and I'm very excited to share that in 2019 uh, we'll be opening our newest facility, which is the management decision room, uh, which will basically simulate a high-pressure boardroom environment, 
uh, giving the students a uh, first-hand experience as to what it's like when you want to make key strategic decisions. Uh, the Curtin Business School is also heavily industry connected uh, and students have the opportunity to engage in on-campus as well as off-campus uh, industry-based events and internship. Uh, we've got the Chamber of Commerce and Industry on campus uh, and they provide a host of networking opportunities and, facil and facilitate a number of internships. So such work integrated learning really helps students become industry ready. Uh, students also have a number of opportunities to participate in international study tours uh, and also study abroad and exchange uh, arrangements that we have with world class universities across the globe. Uh, and this will help them further immerse themselves in different cultural environments and basically maximize their learning experience to prepare for the future. Uh, as we believe that these uh, uh, mobility experiences are very important for graduates of the future. Uh, CBS also attracts students from different parts of the world uh, and students would uh, have the opportunity to develop a truly immersive multicultural experience and develop lifelong uh, friendships uh, with people from different cultures. Yep, so I coordinate the, uh, the new and exciting Master of International Business and Entrepreneurship course. Uh, now the course itself was designed uh, based on input from industry as well as our advisory board members. Uh, and it basically aims to develop uh, industry ready graduates, uh, give them the necessary confidence, uh, skill sets and knowledge uh, in international business and entrepreneurship. Now, several units in this course are taught by academics with significant industry experience, uh, as well as by industry experts, uh, and our close proximity to Curtin's uh, IP commercialization, as well as Tech Park, gives students the opportunity to engage uh, more with industry. Students also have uh, opportunities uh, through credit for recognized learning to take part in a one-week intensive entrepreneurship bootcamp called Curtin Ignition, which is held on campus uh, uh, at Bentley. And this Ignition basically brings together industry experts um, to coach, mentor, as well as advise students on their entrepreneurial uh, aspirations. Now, students also wow. have the opportunity in this course to take part in the prestigious uh, MIT Global Innovation Bootcamp, which is held uh, in many different locations uh, every three months or so. Uh, and once again, this bootcamp is taught by academics as well as uh, industry experts uh, over a one week period. Uh, students also have the option of uh, taking part in an international study tour. And we've got some exciting locations on offer such as Silicon Valley, where students get the opportunity to visit companies such as Facebook, Tesla, Salesforce, uh, and so on, and also stay on campus at either Stanford University or UC Berkeley. Uh, the second location that we have on offer is Switzerland, uh, which ranks number one uh, as far as the Global Innovation Index is concerned, and students get the opportunity to visit large multinationals such as Novartis and some leading startups in that location. Now, so scholarships are part of Curtin's commitment to rewarding uh, academic excellence uh, and support, uh, supporting basically research and enabling students from all backgrounds to avail of these scholarships. So having said that, there are a number of scholarships on offer uh, and these are available for both domestic as well as international students. Uh, they are available for coursework and higher degree by research degrees. Uh, and also open to undergraduate as well as postgraduate courses. Um, so it's best if students uh, log on to the scholarships.curtin.edu.au website and then browse through uh, the different scholarships on offer. Well, Curtin is ranked in the top 1% of universities worldwide. And Curtin Business School is recognized as an elite business school through its accreditation by AACSB and has also received a four palms of excellence rating from Ed Universal. Also, our MBA holds the EPAS accreditation 
uh, from the European Foundation for Management Development. So depending on your chosen degree, the entry requirements will be different. Uh, so we recommend that you search for your course uh, and the specific entry requirements on study.curtin.edu.au. Uh, in general, there are two admission criteria, which is the academic criteria as well as the English language criteria. Uh, in general, as far as the English language criteria is concerned, uh, you need to have an IELTS score of 6.0 for undergraduate as well as postgraduate courses. Now, if you do not meet both these criteria, uh, you could gain admission into your chosen curtain course through uh, different pathways.